Holy mother God. Once everything's settled up, I'm calling the man I know, having him bring over three hookers. Boy, ain't All no right. hooker ever stepping foot in this house. You sure? Because two of them are for you. <laughs> I'm gonna be fucking in my new drifter. I'd appreciate that. You know, my entire life, there's always been someone standing over me, telling me where I could go, what I could do, who I could be seen with. This. What you boys did tonight. This changes everything. This isn't just money. It's freedom. Real freedom. There ain't no one standing over me again. <laughs> over any of us. Vouloir c'est pouvoir, eh? Vouloir c'est pouvoir! Well, well, well. Man, it's self. And look at what I dug up. You mind pouring one more of those? Holy <laughs> shit. It'll be my pleasure. Judge, he told me ship went sideways during the robbery. Lincoln had to save your ass. You should be damn proud of that, boy. I am, Sal. More than you'll ever know. <coughs> oh, Jesus Christ, that is some down-home hooch right there, isn't it? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Listen, I got a guy outside. Y'all mind if he comes in and packs up my cut? Not at all. Let's see if you can handle this down home hoot. Yeah, I'll give you some of that. Trying to get some corn whiskey. Make you a man. <laughs> they all the same. <laughs> hey, take the one on here. It's your cut. Plus what I owe you. Even put in a little extra for your trouble. Couldn't have pulled it off without you, Sammy. Y'all done right by me tonight. Mwah. Mwah. Why don't you get us something off the top shelf? We need to celebrate. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You ain't got to tell me, <laughs> yeah. boys. Hey, fill me up. All right. Know right. something, Lincoln? Possibly the baddest motherfucker I ever laid my eyes on. She shouldn't have said no. Where the fuck you think you're going? Stupid fucking nigga. Come on, grab that bag. Let's go. When I got to Sammy's, the whole place was burning. I still don't know what brought me there that night. Luck? Divine Providence? Or something else? Lincoln out of the fire, he woke up long enough to tell me to call John Donovan. So that's what I did. Most days I wish I'd never made that call. Mr. Donovan, do you know this individual? Sure. Sal Marcano. Mm -hmm. And how about this man? That's Sal's worthless piece of shit, brother Lou. Look. Enough with the dog and pony bullshit. What's your real question? Did you help Lincoln Clay murder Sal Marcano and all prominent members of his crime family? You're goddamn right I did. I see the moon rising. I see trouble on the way. I see there wakes of lightning. I see.
So those the men you're gonna kill, huh? That's the plan, Padre. It's a dangerous course you're contemplating. And what do you think we should do? Sal Marcano deserves to die. I won't argue otherwise. Kill him. But let that be the end of it. That's not enough! It's enough if you say it's enough. I know what Sal did to you, Lincoln. But nothing you do will bring any of them back. This isn't about bringing them back. Or even exacting some street justice. It's about making that bastard feel what it's like to lose everything. Watch as I take it all away from him. This is a one-way road, Lincoln. And once you start down it, there ain't no turning back. I'm going to Sammy's to get my stuff. You ready? I'll be waiting in the car. <sighs> Taught us kids to turn the other cheek. Now fight back. Problem is that don't work. Not in the real world. 